What's going on, people? So uh, today we have a review for Vape Wild's Wrecking Ball. This is described as a banana cream pudding. Uh, no, but we're gonna get into that in a second. Um, I actually got this as a sample. This is a 10 milliliter bottle, uh, one and a half or three milligram nick. It's got nick in it, I know that. Um, 65, 35 PG, uh, 65 BG, 35 PG. So not my favorite blend. Um, this is a little strong. It's a little strong with the 65 in there. I prefer a Max VG blend for basically all of my shit, or 70 plus is fine. This, the only reason why this is a little iffy is because it's, it's a strong flavor. Um, let's actually dive right in. I've got this on my drop with the G150 smoke uh, and Digi flavor. Shout out to the Vapor Chronicles. Um, yeah, you're fucking awesome, man. You make really, really good shit. And I'm not just saying that, although I would love to see a 28 millimeter of the drop. Um, I would love to see that. I think that'd be sexy as shit. Um, you know, do something different with the airflow, but keep it 28 and rock a big thing. Anyway, why are we talking about that? This is Wrecking Ball. Fresh Wick, uh, twisted 24 gauge Canthal, single coil, three and a half millimeter bit. Kind of high, the coil is up high. And I did extra long wicks, so they really do droop. You don't really have to do that with this, but I figured, fuck it, I want flavor, and I'm not gonna keep this flavor in there forever once this 10's gone. Inhale. Sweet. Kind of, um, kind of peppery. Not like peppery, but like, um, peppy. There we go. Zesty. It's got like a tropical fucking flavor to it. Um... To me, inhale, um, you know, people who say inhale, it's like, okay, really, unless it's a super menthol-y vape or a super fucking lemony vape, inhale just tastes like fucking sweet. Realistically, you can't taste shit until you breathe out, so we'll just go right into the exhale. I do love this flavor. Um, exhale. I'm not gonna lie to you and say it's real banana. It tastes like runted, like runty bananas, like that sort of little candied banana. Um, sort of like that hard candy fruit that they have another fucking vape for. But um, it's a banana flavored, you know what, suck on the candy type of vape. But it has this cream note and the cream is subtle and it also has, it also tries to have like this banana peel, like a, like a, like a, uh, I don't know, kind of greenish banana. Not like super, super green, but it definitely has that stemmy, fruity, banana eeness underneath. But it's not like rich banana. It's candy banana with a little bit of that fruit sort of stem, you know, peel banana smell. When you smell the drip tip, you get a tropical smoothie. I'm sorry, but I smell a tropical smoothie in this. I don't know who the fuck else gets that, but that's what I'm getting out of this beast. And I've I've had this numerous times before. I was gonna order more, but I decided on Surf Cake instead because I prefer that. It's a little more mellow. This, this is, I'm gonna turn this fucker up. This is good. Um, yeah, kind of a candied with undertones of real banana, cream, uh, tropical drink smoothie. That's I, that's more of what I'm getting, not like a banana cream pudding. So I don't know what's up with that, but um, I'll leave it right there. Sure. Um, but that's basically this flavor is, you know, it's, it's getting one thumb. The reason why it's not getting two thumbs is because I can't vape it all day. Um, here. Right here. Thanks. And uh, that's that, Frank. Uh, it's a good fucking vape. Um, definitely... It would get two thumbs if it was Max VG. So you know what? I'm actually going to give it two thumbs. It's a good fucking flavor. Um, it's it's definitely for sweet, sweet lovers, you know? It's not like a sugared a cinnamon or like a kind of a glazed sweet. It's a candy sweet with a smoothie banana cream noise on it. It's it's good. It's good. Peace out. Stop. Recording.